You mentioned that VAT isn't as pernicious as a personal income tax. Can you just explain this? Effectively, a 1% increase in the rate of VAT increases the amount the, the, or decreases the amount available to spend by 1% what you were going to do. Whereas the increases in personal tax that we experienced last year and middle and upper income groups are going to experience this year is far more than 1% of disposable income. South Africa has seen a significant decline in productivity. What can be done to rectify this? The most important contribution to an improvement in productivity is to improve the outcomes of our educational system. And that does not necessarily mean sending more students to university. It means improving the proportion of the, uh, the qualification, the pro a number of qualifications out of university of those going to university. Secondly, it also means increasing the pro uh, effectiveness of TVET and other artisanal colleges that give people who are not at that academic skills mm -hmm. to be gainfully employed to add value. Once people can add value, they are more likely to be employed, more likely to earn an income that actually contributes then towards a reduction in inequality. What do you think will be done with the hornet's nest that is the SOEs? The government didn't give away too much in the budget in terms of what it's going to do with the SOEs. Yes, uh, a starting point of course has been the uh, reappointment of new boards at uh, ESCOM and South African Airways and what they said is they're going to do the same with Danel. But over and above that, uh, a lot of attention has to be paid to procurement processes. The SOEs are also in huge financial straits and the, in the budget all that was said is the government is looking at possible equity injections or strategic partnerships without actually being explicit about what they meant or incurring more debt. But uh, clearly the government is not very keen itself to lend SOEs more money. Uh, strategic partnerships, are they talking privatization? They dare not use the word because ideologically that is unacceptable, but clearly there is a huge opportunity to resolve the problem through appropriate strategic alliances with private sector bodies in such a way that there is accountability. Once the private sector uh, businesses have a stake in an SOE, they will want to see a decent return and they will therefore ensure that those SOEs are properly managed and uh, are properly driven to generate a decent financial return. What are some of the misses in Ramaphosa's budget? The big miss, which is understandable I suppose in an election year, is that he increased taxes rather than restricted growth in a bloated public service remuneration uh, bill, uh, which is still set to rise by over 7% per year over the next three years. No signs of that being reduced. Instead, the average man in the street has to cough up in terms of a higher VAT rate, a higher fuel levy, and believe it or not, increased personal taxes, even though personal tax rates were not increased. The fact is that insufficient uh, adjustment was made for the impact of inflation in moving people up the tax ladder. And so a lot of the people, especially those earning over half a million rand, are going to end up paying uh, proportionately far more tax than they did uh, in last year.